Enough trucks, so I shouldn't run out of things to do. Nope, just juice. I have lots of batteries. You have lots of batteries. Yeah. So, you brought your new guy. This is uh, my uh, military build there. Is that because you live close to military people? There is a base not too far from our house, yeah. But uh, this guy here, he's just uh, dying to go crawling there. Well, at you have the a good Sims. Place. At the Sims, you have the good place. So, we'll uh, get some more dirt on here and see what happens. Is it waterproof a little bit? It'll be okay, you'd be surprised. Okay. Let's give it a try. Okay. Start. It really does. Yeah, this thing turns really sharp. That's where he puts his battery. Right up front. You'd have what is that, a beer or Coke? I'll let you decide. Uh, it's written Coke on it. Coke for now, but it's you probably, never know what's inside. Yeah, it's probably spike. You got a map or... Yeah, a map of Earn Prior there, in case I can't find my way home. Where's your pins? Pins what? <laughs> I have pins on my Yeti XL. That's about as long as they get. There's no more pins around here, let me tell you. Oh, okay. It blends with the environment. Yeah, I can't see it there. Where did it go? We do have a little bit of snow here at the Sims. So you're gonna try the gauntlet first? Oh yeah. Just don't tear your mirror out. I think that one has a, has a pin in it. There you go. You're on it. Come on, get up there. Holding that hole. Whoa. There you go. So this is a tricky part where you have to turn yourself around though. Yeah, you're telling me. S, S. What do you call those? S, uh, S turns? Canada's worst driver? We call it C turns. <clears throat> Crappy. Well, somebody's having fun over there. Yeah. I usually drive on the rope and then try to go back a little bit, but okay, there I usually drive as much as I can on the rope and then back up again. Usually straightens up rope. Oh, that would work too. Oh, I might have to use the rope and the log there. No, I don't know. no, the, you should fit on these two rope. It's SEX10 width, but those are narrow tires. Yeah, this is a really small yeah, truck. So, so use a rope and the log. I never tried it with mine yet. But this is where I usually back up to straighten it because you won't get your back wheels on it. Maybe I can just drag it. Maybe. If you get off, you won't be able to get your bumper back up. Saved by the mirror, that's what they're for. See that? <laughs> yeah. They're for saving your truck from falling off the gauntlet. Let me cheat there and see if I can get it to go. Let me cheat there and see if I can get it to go. Let me cheat there and see if I can get it to go. Amazing how well it lines up by itself. Amazing. No lights yet? No. You must have built this right. 
because the ropes are staying right in line. That's amazing. Oh, you did a good job on this one. You did a good job on that one, sir. Very, very nice. Oh, that's where your long wheelbase might give you trouble. Just trouble, he doesn't know where it is. Oh, good thing there's that little uh, branch to stop you there. Did on purpose leave him there, little stubs. Oh, he does get out. Oh, your rear your, your one does. Oh, I'm caught on the fender there. Oh, yeah. There we go. Yeah, now your real axle is caught on the... Yeah. Yeah, it's stuck right in the front there. No, there's nothing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> you ain't going nowhere. Nope. Get the tow, tow, tow rope out. Yeah. There we go. Military style. Call for help. Uh -huh. Very good. Oh yeah, it's for setting it up there? Yeah, because I, I do have flags that I set up. You like trucks with big tires, I think. Well, it's because my son runs it with his race. Yeah. So I do have to make it, make it a little challenging. Yeah. To this, I'm not sure you'll be able to, but... Challenging for that truck here, I think. Well, this is basically the only spot that's going to be challenging. The rest should be kind of easy. Because these sometimes back up, but they should be closer so you, you grab it. You can but, pull a bit. Yeah. But people keep moving them. Yeah. That's what happens when you have friends over. Yeah. Okay, I'll. There you go. I, I shot just the front so people won't know you keep pushing it. Unless they hear the audio. Now, when you get off, either stick to the left or to the right. Go over, don't go over that route or else you'll get stuck. Here, you do have to kind of give it a jerk or else you won't get the up. Oh yeah, you're a bumper. Me too. I usually go on the other side, but... There you go. Little side hill. Very oh, nice. And side and up a hill. This is a great trail, man. It's really nice. I raked all this this morning. Call this a log farm. 
And I did on purpose to leave the uh, logs loose. Geared yeah. down? These have a very high gearing and dip. Right? Yeah, they're very small uh, ranger. So here, I see I cleaned on the right and you can go on the left? Yeah. Stay on the right. One up there. The 2.2 or the Wraith, I usually tell them to go on the other side. <laughs> There's water there though. It's not that deep. There's more ice on it. But... We're better off hugging them right here. This trail is made more for one bigger 1.9s. Papa! But we need to put some new. It's like a guy. It's not a guy, wait. See? He's five and he, yeah. he knows it's a war one. Yeah. This is we're, a, we're on our way. This is a class one trail. Is it? Trail. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Definitely class one. Hug the tree on your, on your way up. Go where? On the on the Oh. Not right now, because i got to go set this. Where's Shane? Where's Shane? the new beast, Where's Shane? I think from the fruit for sure. He's got camouflage. Come on, go. Oh, yeah. I got a tree right there my truck. Oh, yeah? Oh yeah. Yeah, you do. In the rear. There you go. Come on, 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 Come